All right, once we finish our floor plan, roof plan, and elevation, we're going to now um, check some of the things that we might have missed. Uh, like, for example, we, we added these uh, porch columns last, and so we need to delineate where the porch and the patios are by drawing a line. So we're simply going to draw a line, and we're going to just use our uh, layer walls. Um, so where's our layer wall? Here we go. Here we go. Layer wall. But we want it to be thin, so I'm not going to change the color here. I'm going to override it by selecting red. Okay. So I just want it thin. And then I'm going to just simply do a line. Line from this corner to this corner. Straight line. And then line from this corner to perpendicular here. Okay. And I'll do the same thing. Over here, we're going to do just a line from this corner to this corner, and then another line from this corner and perpendicular, PER, to this. Alright, so that delineates our porch and our patio. And as you can see, I've changed all, all my colors uh, from yellow to gray. And you can do that by simply going to your layer property and changing all of your uh, yellow color for your furniture and kitchen to uh, gray. So I use 254 okay, for, for those colors, 254. Um, next, uh, once you've done that, uh, you want to look at your floor plan and then make sure that the title, the scale, sheet numbers are correct. Okay, And then do a preview and inspect your floor plan. Um, because you might have encountered some problems like this one, you know, like this this tub um, is going over the line of the wall, so we need to like put it under, and anything else that's disrupting the color of the wall, okay, maybe this one too. So those two, so you can you can uh, only see that when you preview, and you can't check on that one, okay. Oh, also here uh, we don't want this line to be dark too dark and we also need to draw a line here um, in, in front of the in front of the door main door so we're gonna go back and then we can go back to model I'm just used to having it uh, color dark so we can click this and right click and then change just the draw order and we, we want to send that to back okay and the other one here also these two lines we want to send that to back the order sent to back okay we also want this line to be red so we're going to override that to red and we also need to have a line here from here to there all right there you go and then let's do again a preview and it looks like everything looks well okay oh this this too needs to be adjusted also Okay, so we're going to go and do these two and then draw order and send to back. Okay, and I think that's it. So just make sure you inspect that. Uh, for the roof plan, we don't want furnitures. Okay, so we're going to go back here. So for the roof plan over here, I don't want this, don't want this. Uh, I don't want this anymore. The fixtures are okay, but beds uh, and furniture, the one that can be moved. So um, the refrigerator, kitchen counters, and stove, they're considered appliances, so we're going to leave that there. And then the uh, fixtures for the uh, bathrooms um, are going to be considered also permanent, so we're going to leave that there. Okay, so that's what we need to do. And then the elevation is... is uh, um, there's nothing to change there so we just have to go back to our roof plan and make sure that the label is roof plan and then it's A2 okay and then for the elevation it says elevation scale and A3 okay and then we just have to click preview to check how does this look like yeah looks good so just the roof plan uh, and then on the elevation press escape and go pre preview also the elevation and yeah looks looks well okay so those are little things that uh, you need to uh, make sure um, that you've taken care of before we go with our um, final PDF okay